I'd like to welcome everyone to the Stambic IBTC Award for Saving the Denver Life Group. We are gathered here today for the final draws of the year and as we witness the announcement of the winners, we hope that others are inspired to save more and do more with their finances. We know that saving is an important aspect of an individual's journey to financial freedom and stability. And as a financial institution that cares, we will continue to reward and encourage our customers for their dedication towards building a savings culture. In the first month, we had about 92,000 customers qualifying. By the time we moved on to the second month, that number had increased to 134,000. And in this final draw we just did, we had 140,000 customers qualifying for various prizes. So you see that saving culture that we are trying to promote is actually being achieved. This is really just a tip of the iceberg because riding on the success we have seen here, okay, and the growth in the savings culture of our customers, we have a plan to sustain this you know, throughout next year. Uh, more details will be provided as we move into next year, but clearly it's something that we intend to sustain as a way of continuously you know, developing the saving culture and rewarding customers. openness you find in all the draws, it's so open and very direct. Stambic IBTC, first of all, is not a local bank, so we know we've seen your work, so we've seen your events so far, so everything has been transparent and fair. If there's any fulfillment we have, we feel the joy on the faces of the winners month on month. Um, as of today, we've had 180 people win. Um, a hundred thousand naira each. We, we, today, I mean, we did the grand run and we had 12 people from across the country win a million naira each. We've created 12 millionaires today. And um, it's the humbling part of the story. All you needed to do was just keep some money in an account. I won't let the cat out of the bag yet, but no, this is not the end of rewarding savings with Stanley Kaiju. I think it's something that's going to become a culture ultimately. Um, but until we get to that place where every person can think about savings and keep their money, we would encourage people to save. So no, this is not the end of it. We're coming back.